Oh mierda, pensé que no se iba a activar porque ya es tarde. Professor. Oh, it's you, dear boy. Come in, come in and shut the door. What's going on? You leaving? Yes, sir. Yes, I am, sir. You know, you know the thing, the thing that is vital, without which scholarship cannot proceed, sir. No, I don't. I'm not having a bullet in your flipping neck, sir. I am not cut out for this. No, I'm not cut out for this at all. <laughs> nope. They're fucking savages. Savages. I think we all are. Not me, sir. I'm from Connecticut. I'm a professor at Yale. I write books. I do not deserve to die out here. Where's my tincture? Oh, yes. You okay, Professor? Oh, dandy, sir. Just dandy. Oh, great heavens above! Is that you, John? Hello, Dutch. <laughs> I think that's what they call two for the price of one out here in this wonderful place. Maybe so, Dutch. You and, and, and your friend there, the professor? We're gonna kill the both of you. <laughs> Why you want to do a thing like that? I don't know. Sport, I guess. Fair enough. Why don't I come out there? We fight. Let the professor go and send your boys back to their families. Well, that, that sounds like a beautiful plan, John. Only problem is, my boys here, they already lost their families a long time ago. We aren't thieves, John. We're fighting for something a bit like you. Only we're fighting for an idea. Not just for ourselves. That's beautiful, Dutch. You always were a fine speaker. I was. Now, would you kindly send that academic out here so we can show him what we really think about the art of anthropology? Lisa, what are we going to do? I'm going to hand you over to him and watch him tear you limb from limb. What? I'm just kidding. We're going to run across the rooftops. Get you back to your ivory tower. Oh, thank you. Thank you, sir. Don't thank me. We're still here. Come on. Good day, sir. Uh, madam. Look here, sir. What is the meaning of this, this outrage? To stay down and shut up. Come on, we can get to the roof this way. Okay, vamos a hacer parkour con uno de los hombres menos atléticos y flexibles que he visto en los videojuegos. It's gonna be fun. When are you sending the men out to fight? Oh, you took your sweet time. Easy game, bro. Oh, he's seeing those bundles of sniper. Ok, bueno, si quieren jugar a eso What? Vení ¿Dónde pitos? Ah, right, well, I can see one Sir, please Stop pointing! 
here for Christ's sake. What? Oh. Era ese mismo sujeto. Works for me. I think that's most of them. Easy game. Come on then, let's make a break for it. Yeah. The horses should be in an alleyway down here. Yeah, that was close. Let's go ahead for a key. Whoop. We're going in. Come on, let's get the hell and out of we're off. Ah, si sí, tomas balas de rifle, así que por un rato voy a utilizar la carabina. No es como que los enemigos tengan más HP, siguen siendo personas. Por los enemigos. Just in time. You're making a big mistake, friend. Oh, well then. Those are still not on hunt on me. But it's okay, indeed. Those are the most common que si tienen un poquito más de HP por alguna razón. Es que su sangre de pinche. Y el roja salvaje, pinche caballo, muévete. El cabrón va con el culo en la mano. Estoy güey ahí pendejeando. Ay, oh, mira, este poste es de calidad inimaginable. a salir una vez que tomamos el camino secundario la bifurcación si ustedes gustan what the fuck mataron a mi caballo es de puta Creo que es la primera vez que matan directamente a mi caballo Pobre güey Se le pasa por quedar viendo Quedarse viendo los postes John Vamos, oh, deja que saque el imbécil solo Oh no, oh no Ok, uh. Come on. Hey, que el compa mató su... No, never mind Let's go! This might have been a bad 
Sí, spamea, vale madre. De aquí a que me... No, se alcance. Ay, no estuvo tan mal. Supongo. Manzanita Post. Weird name. Ah, my research is complete. Much as I thought. There's no civilizing this savage land. I could have told you that for nothing. Ah, but they'll give me a prize in New Haven for this. <laughs> well, they bloody better. Well, goodbye, Mr. Marston. <laughs> Best of luck, dear friend. So long, Professor. So long, sir. Ok, por fin. La última misión con este sujeto. Gana 100 dólares por alguna razón. Mi caballo sigue vivo. Así que, ¿qué les parece? Si hago un pequeño campamento por aquí. Uh, aquí suena bien Y vamos de regreso a Blackwater Creo que todavía tengo suficiente tiempo en este video para hacer otra ¿Cómo se llama? Misión antes de irme Antes de terminar el video, más Bien Ay, Ay. Y es de día, lo que significa que debería poder empezar la otra misión inmediatamente. No tengo tiempo para estupideces moradas. Digo, se ve bonito y todo, es morado. Es el mejor color de la existencia. Pero... Ah, side quests, no gracias. Marston. My family. I've done what you asked. No, you haven't. This is the land of opportunity, and I gave you the opportunity to save your family, and you failed. How could I possibly manage you? Marston, you're a public menace. We should have had you killed. I wish you had. But since you didn't, where's my family? Spare me the noble savage fall on the sword tripe, will you? Oh boy, it's nauseating. You don't wish to be dead. You're an insignificant creature desperately clinging on to life like the rest of the scum in this town. Yeah, I know it's tough. You like Dutch. He's a charming fellow. He makes sense. He's like one of those nature writers from back east. Only he takes things a tiny little step too far. Rather than just loving the flowers and the animals and the harmony between man and beast. <laughs> he shoots people in the head for money. And disagreeing with them. He's a goddamn killer. Now. I'm not a great intellect. But the metaphysical leap from admiring the flower to shooting a man in the head because he doesn't like the flower is a leap too far. So, I know it's easy. <laughs> you see, we, me and Archer, we're the bad guys. We enforce the rules. Now, while the rules may not be perfect, they're really not so bad. Exactly. What's the alternative? Yeah. See, I'll tell you what the alternative is. It's not complicated. It's about one man and his gun versus another man. Sure. 
Civilization may be dull, but the alternative, Mr. Marston, is hell. And the way you enforce this civilization, this freedom for men to like or not like flowers, or whatever in God's name you were just talking about, is to kidnap a man's wife and son? Well, I know there's contradictions. I'm not gonna lie to you. <laughs> As I said, I'm not a great intellect. Now, after the debacle with the army and the bank, we have to put Mr. Vanderlyn to rest ourselves. Will you help us? Do I have any choice? Now that you mention it, no. Then what was that pretty speech in aid of? I don't rightly know, but it sure felt good saying it. <laughs> Shall we, Mr. Marston? Let's go. Porque putas siempre traigo la recortada equipada ¿Cuándo fue la última vez que lo utilicé? No hace mucho de hecho, pero... ¿Quién es? ¿Dónde mero pues? Venga los malos Vamos a posición your men ready to run them down if you have to. Dispense! Load weapons and get to the sandbag! Move! Are you ready to finish this, Mr. Marston? I guess so! Vamos a diga más. Jejeje. Que primero los de los caballeros que son los más fáciles de matar. Están en movimiento y no están cubiertos. No, cualquier tarado que asome su estúpida cabeza. Va a recibir suficiente plomo en el cuerpo como para morir un par de veces por envenenamiento, ni siquiera por la paz. Esa es la verdadera parte que dice pinche caballín, perdón, pero pues GG. Libertad. Jesus, ¿está bien, carnal? ¿Qué el trae el vitre de dinamita? Ese sujeto está muy bien atrás de las rocas. Ah no, malo top. Sí, sí. Okay. Voy a parar la parada enfrente de tres muy perfectos lugares para esconderme. Siento que estoy más seguro aquí. Sí, sí, Mr. Molotov. Hablando de genios. 
Okay, ¿quién sigue? O sea, eso. Ah, sí, sí. Yo seguro que ese fin está disparando con una escopeta. De lejos. A un vehículo armado. Genius. Esos eran compis, ¿verdad? Bueno, GG. Eso significa que no necesito que... Ayudes. Y la verdad os hará, os hará libres. Well then. Well, Mr. Marston, it seems like your mentor Dutch no longer looks quite so kindly to a student. That man is insane. So it seems. I think we need to get him before sundown. As you say, Captain. Otherwise, he'll be gone again. And what if I say no? <laughs> Now, before I shoot you myself, let me just point out the obvious. The one person we have left that can appeal to Mr. Vanderlyn is the last person we know who knows him. Your wife. That won't be necessary. Mr. Ross, Captain, let's go! <clears throat> Te mueves rápido, pinche anciano. Ok. Creo que esta es la primera vez que voy a hacer esto. Pero... Voy a dejar el video aquí. Literalmente a media misión. Porque llevamos 20 minutos. Entonces... Muchas pues gracias por ver el video. Yo soy Rato Mexican Gamer. Espero que les haya gustado. Nos vemos en el próximo. Voy a dejar a estos imbéciles atrás. No me importa qué es lo que tengan que decir. Yo solamente quiero llegar allá. Y equivocarme de camino, porque what the fuck not. Ahora sí. Yo los veo en el próximo.